can't just say how delighted I am that this has turned out. It's so much better than expected. So this was the spray concrete that I had bought for the handles. It didn't quite work out. Um, and yeah, it just looks, if I stand back, it just looks so much better than that. So I've taken out, um, Colin's just in the middle of doing the vinyl wrap. Um, but we've taken this one out, we're going to spray paint that one and then try and get this one out as well. Okay, this is a like total, um, total, total fluke. Look, it actually looks like it matches. We totally didn't even, like that just wasn't even in the plan. How awesome is that? So there was the shelf up here which we took down um, and we discovered this cable runs through it. So we've decided we're not going to put the shelf back up um, because we want this nice clean line. Um, but obviously we need to hide this cable. So we've just got some trunking um, and we're just going to just put it across here. Um, and yeah, just be a nice, clean, clean line. Who are you growling at? Who are you growling at? Hmm? Vinyl wrap. I can't, I still, this looks, just looks a new countertop. I'm honestly thinking about redoing my actual kitchen. I mean, you can't even, I mean, it's just so good. I mean, this, we did actually have a, a darker concrete um, and we did make a mistake because when we were doing this ledge here, we should have really used a template and we didn't so we ended up like wasting a whole um because this is all one piece we've done it all in one piece um so what we did was the sink and the tap we took those out and then we just lay the whole piece along and then stuck it down and then just cut round so there's no joins this is all 
like one piece down here. Excuse, please excuse this. I should have cleaned that. Um, but I'm just so excited to get this done. So um, yeah, so that was just like all one piece, and then we have also vinyl wrapped this countertop here and the dinette table too and i just think it looks awesome we were going to get like a wood but we had so much left over so we ended up just doing it and i think it goes really well with the vinyl like the vinyl wrap the trees like the color matches like pretty cool it's just so weird like i think wow, once we get the the cushions reupholstered it's just gonna look so much better it's gonna be like so fresh so the vinyl wrapped here with this beautiful tree stuff and then inlays here and then this wall that's all vinyl wrapped with the same and then we ended up just carrying it right round so if I come back so hopefully once we get the cushions reupholstered it's just gonna look awesome also vinyl wrapped this little bit in here rather than paint it because we put a lot of our bags on here and um Crixus's food and water bowl generally goes down here on the floor so we kind of figured with the chalk paint um it would end up just constantly getting marked and scratched and we'd constantly have to um, be touching up so we decided to vinyl wrap that area instead um, i don't know how i feel about it but from a practicality point of view um it's it's definitely uh, the best way to go um and you know this stuff it's like it's, it's th this is the DC fit stuff. It's just from being cute. It's like six pound a roll or something. It's like so hard wearing. Um, yeah, it, it's awesome. Um, and also, you know, if any water gets spilled or, um, you know, anything like that, it's just so easy to clean. And uh, yeah, so that's why we did that. Um, we don't really use a dinette apart from like really storage when we're away. So. There's a little bit of mark just there, but you know, it's, I mean, I'm just so delighted with how that's turned out. Mm -hmm. 